Hello, everyone. Thanks for your coming. I am glad here to present our paper, Point Cloud Upsampling via Disentangled Refinement. Point clouds produced by 3D scanning are often sparse, non-uniform, noisy and contain small holes. Obviously, we need to amend such raw data, before we can effectively use it for general analysis. Point cloud upsampling is to generate a dense point set from the sparse inputs. The generated dense points should cover the surface with a uniform distribution. Also, we need to ensure it less noise and fill small holes. As an inference-based problem, these goals are very demanding, due to the limited information available in the sparse input. The existing methods aim to achieve these goals by designing one upsampling module, which mostly implemented by duplicating the features. However, it is very hard for a network to meet all the requirements at the same time. Therefore, the dense points produced by existing works still tend to be non-uniform or retain excessive noise. After revisiting the point cloud upsampling task, we propose to disentangle the task into two sub-goals. The dense generator is to first generate a coarse but dense point set with less details to roughly describe the underlying surface. And a spatial refiner is to refine the coarse points to better cover the underlying surface for distribution uniformity. Compared with current upsampling methods, our disentangled design has two advantages. First, our refinement pipeline assigns lower requirements to each sub-network, making them more focused on their own sub-goals. Second, the cascading scheme allows the two sub-networks to complement each other during network learning, thus leading to a substantial performance boost. For the architecture design, we formulate an end-to-end -end disentangled refinement framework, which consists of two cascaded sub-networks. For the dense generator, we adopt a simplified module design from the existing upsampling approaches. For the spatial refiner, we design a pair of local and global refinement units to refine the local and global geometric structures respectively. We conducted extensive experiments on both synthetic and real scanned datasets. For the synthetic dataset, we use the benchmark dataset provided by Pu Gan. For real scanned dataset, we use scan object NN. We first show the quantitative comparisons on all the synthetic test models under different upsampling rates. Here, we employ three metrics to evaluate the upsampling point sets. For all metrics, lower is better. We can see that our method achieves the lowest values on all the evaluation metrics in terms of both upsampling rates. Here, we show the visual comparison results of point cloud upsampling on the synthetic data. We can see that our dense points can well preserve tiny local structures with a uniform point distribution. We also show the associated error maps, where the colors represent the nearest distance from the target point set to the predicted point set. We can see that the errors of our upsampled results are the lowest and most points are blue, which is also verified by both CD and HD values. Here, we also show results of point cloud upsampling and the corresponding mesh reconstruction results on real scanned dataset. The results of previous methods tend to be noisy and non-uniform, thus leading to low-quality reconstructed meshes. Our method enables to produce uniform dense points and our reconstructed meshes can well describe the geometric structures with smooth and complete surfaces. Here, we validate the complementary strengths of our dense generator and spatial refiner. To do so, we plot the evaluation curves for the course outputs and the refined results during the training process. At the early training stage, our framework first focuses more on the course output. But as the training progresses, the performance of the refined results are rapidly improved and surpasses the course outputs and both eventually converge to a similar level. This verifies the effectiveness of our disentangled design. Here, we present a visual result to validate the effectiveness of the global and local refinement units. Compared with the full pipeline, when we remove the global refinement unit, the geometric structure of the bull's feet cannot be well preserved. When we remove the local refinement unit, the fine details are lost. More detailed ablation study can be found in our paper. Here is the conclusion, we present a disentangled design for point cloud upsampling. Based on its multi-objective nature, we formulate an end-to-end -end disentangled refinement framework with two cascaded sub-networks, a dense generator and a spatial refiner. Experimental results demonstrate the superiority of our method over previous methods on both synthetic and real scanned datasets. Thanks for your listening. You can find all resources on our website.